back home. Let's talk about sport. Luton have appointed a new manager. Linda is at Kenilworth Road now. Linda. I am, and it was here at Kenilworth Road from here that the new manager could hear the roars of the crowd from the house he grew up in, in Dukesbury Road, just down the road. So Kevin Blackwell, the new man, is a real hometown boy. Blackwell was sacked by Leeds in September after taking them the previous year to the playoff final, and today he signed a four-year deal at Kenilworth Road. Now, they hope that the local lad will be the man who's able to stop them dropping down into League One with just seven games to go. Luton born and bred and now the man who's trying to save his hometown club from the drop. Kevin Blackwell <laughs> never played for the Hatters but the ex-Leeds boss is determined his players will be playing in the championship again next season. We know they've got the character and we know they've got the ability and really uh, with a little bit of luck. To a certain extent is it coming home then? I would say it is coming home. Um, but, uh, you know, I want to take Luton to another level. Um, I've been sort of managing and coaching now in the top two divisions for the last 10, 10 years. And for me, that's where, you know, we've got to be. Mike Newell was sacked for alleged gross misconduct after hitting out at the board once too often. And fans are upset that his contract allowed him a 10% cut of transfer fees. A lot of Luton fans have been disappointed to hear that, that Mike Newell got a contract which said that he could have a cut of transfers. I think they would like to have their fears allayed that that perhaps is not going to happen this time round. Well, you can have that. Um, I, I believe in, in, in uh, looking after a football club and part of that is to show responsibilities and uh, I won't be having any um, clause in my contract, that's for sure. Blackwell met the players this morning and will be looking to end a run of six straight defeats, which has left the club second from bottom, starting at Burnley on Saturday. Well, I think as a Luton fan, you, you know, you, you, we want to be told uh, things that are positive, and I think there's going to be some positive things coming out uh, in the next week or two, and, and let's like say, you've got to watch this space. And when you say as a Luton fan, does that mean that you were a boy growing up as a, uh, a Hatters fan? Yeah, I mean, I stood on the, the Oak Road. Uh, my dad brought me for the very first time, Luton versus Halifax, over in the Bobber stand over there. So, yeah, I have uh, an affinity to the football club, and my first, uh, you know, taste of professional football was watching Luton Town Football Club. The Blackwell era is unlikely to make as many national headlines as his predecessor, but if he gets Luton out of the mire, this hometown boy will truly be a real local hero.